that's the uh, Tomorrowland side of the Matterhorn. I, I do believe, I think, not that I don't like the Tomorrowland side, but I do believe I am now a, a Fantasyland side guy. Uh, it's, I don't, I don't need, need to be super fast, so I don't need to go on the Tomorrowland side. It's just a smoother ride on the Fantasyland side. Fantasyland side. That's all there is to it, man. It's been even longer since we've been on Autopia, so we're gonna ride that one next as soon as this guy pulls up. That's our car right there. And we've got uh, Max and Zoe with us. They'll be in the two cars in front of us. All right, let's go fresh baked. Let's do a little Autopia. Autotopia! <laughs> I know that's wrong. That's one of my, that's one of my uh, pet peeves, but people call it Autotopia. So there's, there's Max. Yeah, uh, he's giving us a hello. And that's his girlfriend in the car in front of us, that's Zoe. They uh, joined us for a little ride on Autopia. Uh-oh, I stalled. There we go. It's hard to believe that we're actually, I forget, we're right now, we are driving on top of the Finding Nemo showroom, I think. I think that's, yeah, this is about where it's at. And, you know, some people talk about, uh, you know, let's get a bit of Autopia and put something else there. You can't because, you know, we're on top of an attraction and there's, you gotta put in a foundation and all that stuff. So uh, it, would, it would destroy the Finding Nemo uh, showroom. And Zoe is way ahead of us. Look at that, she's way over there. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God, I'm driving so badly. It's like the Matterhorn queue backed up a little bit since we were there. That's now a good 20 minutes, probably. And down the stretch they come. I don't think we're gonna win, though. while we're in the neighborhood. I think it's a great idea, a great opportunity to catch the Disneyland Railroad from the Tomorrowland Station while we watch the Autopia traffic go by. I've not been on the railroad for quite a while either, so uh, boy, it's been, yeah, it's been like six weeks again. Last time was at night. Better during the day, I think. You see the monorail right there? It just went by. You know, this, this spot in the park right here, the Tomorrowland train station is an excellent and one of the best examples of how well obscured the park is to the outside world that's the berm the the, the infamous berm that was constructed uh, of all the dirt that they piled up you know during the original construction of the park they built this berm around the perimeter just on the other side of that that hill of dirt right there not more than you know 20 30 yards is harbor boulevard anaheim proper a very busy and industrious city and it's i mean you can't even you'd have no idea it, but it, there it is it's, it's just right over that hill amazing and you can kind of see the monorail track right there too. They're calling us, it's just about time. Here it comes. boarded and we're gonna go around for a round trip plus one we're gonna go all the way around back here to Tomorrowland and then one more station to Main Street because after this we're going to DCA to those joining us welcome aboard the next leg of our journey will take us along the rim of the Grand Canyon 
It's a mighty long drop to the canyon floor. So for your safety, stay seated with your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the train. Be sure. Thank you and say hi to Mickey for me. This is true. 